Good afternoon, everyone. Ron is off today. Three members of a North Syracuse family died early this morning in a fire that gutted their home. When firefighters arrived, all access to the inside of the home was blocked by smoke and fire, and parts of the flooring were gone. Only after the fire was out were the bodies recovered. The cause is unknown. The victims are identified as 22-year-old Chris Cagwin, her 17-year-old brother Joshua, and 16-year-old sister Jennifer. Cicero North Syracuse High School dismissed classes early this morning in honor of Joshua and Jennifer, who were students there. About 150 students at the high school stayed behind to talk over their feelings with teachers and counselors who made themselves available. There was another fatal fire early old Joshua and 22-year-old Chris Cagwin. This morning, North Syracuse High School dismissed students early and offered counseling to anyone who requested it. This tragedy, coupled with the plane crash of Pan Am Flight 103, was too much for many kids to handle. You put on top of this a real personal tragedy that occurs to an individual who is in the building, people know, people like, people respect, and, and really kids just love these two young, young people. And when you put that together, there's a lot of emotions that pour out. About 200 students stayed behind to get some counseling or just a shoulder to lean on. Classes that we did have, they were, no one, we didn't do anything because everybody was just so upset. Nobody could speak, nobody could do anything. I mean, it's such a shock. The classes that we did have, they were, no one, we didn't do anything because everybody was just so upset. Nobody could speak, nobody could do anything. I mean, it's such a shock. Do you know it, this is any of the kids? I knew Josh, he was on my wrestling team, and he was a great wrestler. I mean, he was fantastic. He had so much going for him. And Jennifer also uh, was on a member of the basketball team. Both were very good athletes. And I, I really think that the, uh, that the school ma made the right decision. You know, so many young lives taken this week in such a violent way that it really was a lot for the kids to handle and to have uh, clergy there. Clergy will be available and counselors today I really think was uh, a good thing for the school district to do because there was just a real somber sort of a pall over the school this morning out there. Now uh, North Syracuse now that they've dismissed they're gone for the holidays do That's you foresee right. any counseling when the kids come back also after the